Rondequoit police are continuing the search for a suspect who stole a vehicle with a child inside earlier this month. Gio Battaglia joining us now in studio with more on this story and details from officials who are sharing a call on the public. Gio. Natalie, officers say this happened on April 4th when the driver of a vehicle left her child in the car while she went inside a dollar store on East Ridge Road and left the key fob in the ignition. The car was parked in the fire lane when police say it was stolen with the child inside it by an unknown individual. Officers said a cell phone was left in the car, allowing police to track it to the area of Hudson and Merrimack Street. Police adding they had received a call for a child left in a car. Both the child and the car were recovered. Now, the child was not harmed, but one organization I spoke to told me just how lucky this situation turned out to be. The organization Kids and Car Safety says they have documented, documented 29 children nationwide this year who have been left alone in a vehicle that was later stolen. They say even though they see a number of these cases frequently, they are preventable. What we say is we want the parents to be aware that even though you think it's okay to leave a, car, a child in a car for seconds, a child should never be left alone in a car that's running or unintended even for a second because that's all it takes for thieves or suspects to then steal a car and take off with the child. A lot of times parents will think, oh, if I just leave my vehicle here in the parking lot, or if I just leave my vehicle here in our very safe neighborhood um, in this suburb, you know, where crime never happens, that it can never happen to me. Um, and it can happen to anyone. Um, you know what I mean? There are, the world is a, is a great place, but uh, you never know what's lurking. And around Akoit police say this is an ongoing investigation, which we will, of course, keep you updated with as we learn more. Now